What's up everybody? It's Chris coming to you with another episode of My Crazy Crossroads. Look, it's Joey C. Well, what's up guys? Urban Ghost, Urban Exploration. Um, hey, we are actually uh, at this old abandoned nightclub in a really, really horrible part of town here. Um, it's, it's definitely freaky out here. Um, inside, who knows, this place has been abandoned for like 30 years. So we're going to go check it out. We were just driving by and we were like, let's do it. Why not? So here we are. We're going in. Uh, I think we finally are going to have to use our mask because this place is probably not too good. So we'll see you in there. Peace. All right, guys, this place uh, is a place when I was younger, I used to come with my friends. Um, it's been closed for probably since I've been here. Um, it's going to be bad. It's stupid. We shouldn't be in here, but there's an open door, so we're going to go check it out. All right, guys, so I just want to say it was nice knowing you. Because we're going in there. Oh. Mm. It's, just a, it's just a shell of a place now, huh? Oh, yeah, I'm glad we got these masks, Joe. Oh, Joe! What? Come on. What? Actually, <laughs> take a quick little pan around here, but come on. Let's do this while we can. What do I keep hearing things out there? It sounds like gunshots. <laughs> Holy God, are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. Hello? There's a basement? There's a basement. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh God, I'm glad we have these masks. All right. Yeah, there's a lot of mold. There's nothing down here. Oh yeah, I can even smell it through the mask. I'm heading back, Joe. <laughs> yeah, this it's is, bad. This is a All right, guys, we checked it out, so <laughs> it's not a good place to be. It's so strong I can smell it through our mask, so. Thank you again for the masks. Yeah, this is a pretty bad idea. Yeah, it's not good. It's kind of hard to breathe with these masks on, too. Oh, that leads to the outside, I think. Does it? I'm sorry. Okay. Used to come in here and tear up this place, listen to a little TKA, Scars of Love. Stalls, bro. Well, the place has been closed forever, Jeff. Let me hey, check the other one. Oh. Yeah, guys, this is just nothing but uh, a place that's just going to get you sick. There's cobwebs everywhere. Where are your gunshots? Every five minutes. Yeah. Look in that room to the right. It looks like something that look like whole snakes. What are those? Just cabinets. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, this is so fruit. This place. This is wild. This is so wild. <clears throat> I used to actually come here with my friend. Uh, one of which was uh, the guy who is uh, 
letting us use his place for the meet and greet in New York. No, I don't know what the heck that is. Is a fireplace? Uh, I don't think so. Sorry, Joe, those are organs. Yeah, so there's a lot of stuff still in here. It's kind of strange. Looks like it's storage. Oh, there's some, there's some homeless people staying here, Joe. Look at all these cell phones. The old flip phones. The good old days. <clears throat> There's a ton of old cell phones. Really? Yeah. It looks like somebody does construction work in this here, man. Yeah, look at the old Nextel. Yeah, it does. Some of this stuff is probably stolen. Could be, Jeff. Could be that this was a real freaking bad idea coming in here. Yeah. This is some like, look at this, this is nice craftsman and stuff. Yeah, Joe, somebody's staying here, buddy. Usually when you see foil, you see foil like this, most likely they're doing some kind of drugs. Yeah, somebody's a... Somebody's staying here, buddy. What was this, like the DJ booth up here or something? I don't remember. Well, this place is bad. How can anybody stay in this place? Jeez. <clears throat> Is it a warm club? Chemicals maybe didn't make meth in here. Yeah, you see all the the foil here too. They're burning stuff, alcohol pads, little spoon. This stuff is freaky though. You're right, there's a million old cell phones. Yeah, this is weird. <clears throat> so back in the day, I would come in here with my Z Cavaricis on, my Capizio's kicking, tearing up the dance floor, listening to some Stevie B with a full head of hair and a mullet. Joe, there's been about 10 guns. What was that? Maybe they're fireworks. Alright guys, so this is the freakiest thing like in here. This all the stuff here. Now this is a club that Chris used to go to when he was younger. Oh my gosh. Crazy. I'm so proud of my fucking music. Yeah, those are fireworks, I believe. <clears throat> Fourth of July is right around the corner. Well, this is a this is kind of a cool little uh, memory of going, bringing me back to me down memory lane. But there's really not much to this place other than mold and nastiness. Uh, definitely looks like somebody. Uh, Definitely looks like somebody's staying here though. But we thought we'd give it a shot, take a look at it. And Joe and I uh, decided last week because you guys enjoyed us bringing to you the videos that don't always have anything active. So 
this is one of those moments. This is one of those moments that we probably would just throw this video away, but we're gonna post it, let you check it out. <clears throat> There's not much to this place, man. Oh, most likely, well, could be, or it could be storage. I mean, how did people steal a... Guys, you name it, it's probably in here. There's a lot of stuff against this wall here. Buggy, horse and buggy thing? Yeah, yeah, it's a oh, is it? Wow, there's a ton of stuff in here, guys. I just can't believe somebody actually comes in here and stays here. Oh, there's bats in here, too. I hear them chirping. Well, listen, if the drugs aren't going to kill this dude, the mold will. Definitely a guy staying in here. No, you know what it is? It's just the front. Uh, that's where they used to take the money and stuff. Oh, Probably, yeah. Uh, or an office, maybe. Yeah, because you used to come in right there at that front door. <clears throat> the Inferno. Now, it wasn't called the Inferno when I was here. I don't remember what it was called. I want to say it was like... Uh, I don't even... No, I can't even, I can't even say. I was going to say like... I can't, even, I can't even think of anything. It started with a C. Oh, they had a hot body count this year. Well, guess what? They have one here now. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. Wow. Chris, get up on stage for your mail review. I'm the only one here. At least I'll win. 2001. Oh, so this must have been open again. The Inferno was open in 2001, so it definitely wasn't closed for that many years. <clears throat> Hence the fire on the door. The inferno. Well. Yeah, 2001. That's right. Yeah, I was uh, 18 in 2001, right? <laughs> you were 37. <clears throat> well, Joe. I was 39. Yeah. I'm just kidding. I don't know how old I was. This, uh, 2001. This is another one of those ones that we usually toss away, but we'll have to put it up. I want to put this up just because it's interesting. Yeah, it's awesome. Somebody out there? Yeah, I'm sure there is. Again, guys, this is just a very, hey, very... Uh, this light charged all day. It just went dead, bro. Bad area. Are you serious? Yeah, look. It's this weird. It's charged all day. Maybe it is long 
Now, if you guys ever watch Live PD, or ever watch Live PD, um, Pasco County is, uh, was on their, their, sh their uh, sheriff's department. And this is one of the areas that they would frequent. Got a lot of good content on that show from this neighborhood we're in. Yeah, I just had to turn it off and on. All right, I think what we should do, Chris, is for the sake of it, a lights out challenge just for okay. three minutes. Yeah, let's do it. Can we get the hell out of here? Yeah, because I don't think there's anything. Actually, I look scary with the mask on. I know, it's kind of weird, right? All right, lights out. Let's do it. Hold on. Lights out. Oh, oh. Bang, bang, bang. Ah, this is nothing to say. There's a traffic. Yeah, we're not gonna get up. You're not getting anything in here, Joe. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this little impromptu video. I mean honestly we're gonna do anything tonight and um you can ask all of this. We got to check our mask out anyway tonight, guys. So thank you again for the mask. Um, we were actually contemplating driving. Um, off the top of my head, I'm sorry, I can't remember. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. I know I, I know I thanked you. Um, but I'm sorry, I can't recall your name. I'm an idiot and I can't remember things. All right, guys, so thank you for watching. Um, we actually weren't even sure if we were going to shoot anything tonight, but uh, we, we found this place. We thought we'd give it a shot. Um, it's kind of cool to be back in here, um, minus the Capizios and the Z Cavariccis and the mullet and all that good stuff. But um, we are out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed this little video. And uh, we'll see you next time. We're heading out back out to the war zone here. Yeah, so as Chris was mentioning, 